Well, we figured out a few different things, but the main thing is that simplicity equals success. We wanted to limit formations. We wanted to minimize plays. We wanted to get rid of shifting and or motion. We wanted to reduce the amount of positions that players needed to learn. We wanted to always play at cruise control, meaning control the clock. We didn't ever want to change our cadence, and we never, ever, ever wanted to confuse our guys by going on two. We always wanted to make sure that we were organized, and this offense organizes you by default. And then finally, we wanted something that allowed us to focus on small, intricate details. And we feel that this offense does all of those things. All right, so first off, let's look at our formations. All right, we have the king formation. We have three different primary formations. We run a few others, um, but our primary formations, we have three of them. All right, we have our king formation. All right, and in, in our king formation, we do run an unbalanced line. Uh, that that kind of comes from uh, uh, Cross County uh, in Stromsburg. I, I talked about Hayden and Matt Carroll. They're awesome guys. Um, they run something similar to this, but they have they have some real dudes. They have some guys on that offensive line that can block in space. And I love our players, and they know I love them. Um, but I don't put them in space for a reason. Okay, and, and and that reason is is that sometimes we have trouble moving in space. So we get foot to foot, okay? So even though it looks like there's some little space between there, there's no space, and you'll see that here um, when, we, uh, when we flip up here. So when we look at this formation, okay, we have our wing to our strong side and king. We have our fullback three yards off the ball behind our strong guard, and then at about four and a half, heels at four and a half or five um, are our deep back, okay? And we number our backs, one, two, and three. Our fullback is always our one back because our fullback in our system is kind of our quarterback, okay? But I wouldn't insult him by ever calling him that. Um, and then our wing backs are the only people that don't flip sides, okay? My two will always be on the two side unless we call Jack, which we'll talk about here in a second. Uh, or I'm sorry, the right side. And my three will always be on the left side, okay, odds and evens, and that's how we number our holes and gaps as well, all right? Our second formation is jack formation, okay? And in jack formation, we, we call jack right, okay? And jack right is just king right, except for we flip the two, okay? And one of the reasons I call it jack right is because I never want my linemen to have to figure out, well, all of us have to go opposite the call, okay? I think it's much easier to call jack right and have one person say, I just have to go opposite the call. All right, so in this case, instead of my two being to the play side or to the strong side, two flips, all right? And this is a really awesome formation and it really allows you to do some, some unique and can create fun, uh, fun opportunities for your offense. And uh, if you're a little bit more adventurous than, than, than I am, then you can really do some uh, cool stuff uh, out of um, inverted veer. You can run power read option, uh, all sorts of different things. And, and that's stuff that we hope one day to put in, but right now we are not quite there. So, and if you look here, here's Jack formation. You can see that we have uh, that, that strong side, um, that strong side to our right, that weak side uh, to our left. And we, you can see that we have flipped that wing over to the other side. Our last formation, or at least our last primary formation, I'm gonna highlight another one uh, once we get to our film room, but uh, is Joker, okay? And we go Joker right, Joker left. Um, and in this one, uh, if we go Joker left, my three will be my outside, uh, my outside wing, and my one will always stay my inside wing. And we like this. Some people call it beast formation. Um, or whatever you want to call it, but we call it Joker. We like King Joker. Uh, we have a formation that we run sparingly called Queen. Uh, we have a balanced formation we call Ace. So all card names, uh, why card names, I don't know. Uh, it's just who we are and how we do things. So here's Joker formation. You can see it's really uh, difficult to stay balanced and watch that backside and make sure that you don't get outflanked by those two wingbacks.